Hello guys, how are you today? Um, as you can see, I have one of my houses here. Uh, this is actually the one from the only server video from the city. Um, with the curved roof and everything. And we're gonna do a tutorial on this house today, right now. Um, don't mind this side. This side is not done because it was a row of houses and um, this was the place where it connected to the other house so this this doesn't have any details or anything that's the reason why um so yeah uh, let's get started this is also the first tutorial video let me know if you like it um and i'll do more of that okay so to begin we place um oak oak uh, logs f five high one two three three four five with a gap of seven in between so we can do it like this one two three four five six seven just so we know how um, how long this is and then one two three four five again then as you can see a gap of five one two three four five actually we can keep it like this one two three four five one two three four five again oh wow come on one two three four five then a gap of seven again one two three four five six seven one two three four five and then again just like on the other side this one can stay like that and a gap of five again so this is seven just like that then we connect this all like this this is also something you can do to just check um, if you did it right. Like you can do this one, two, th three, four, five, six, seven. So now you know this is seven. So that's totally right. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes. Okay. So um, that's actually it for the ground. Um, then. For this part, we're uh, gonna do the same, but yeah, on top of this one. So we need to do this first and then connect this and then just build higher. So we're gonna do this and this, and then this and this, and connect those. Only on the front and back sides, not on this sides. <coughs> wow. <laughs> My voice cracked. Um, and then just build a pillar of 5 high again. Um, oh wait. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 actually. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And connect those. Then um, we put a pillar in the middle of those. So we have 1, 2, 3, pillar. 1, 2, 3. And then do it like this. You can remove this one and place it like that. And we're gonna do just the same on the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Connect those. And then the pillar in the middle. Boom. Okay. Uh, <coughs> then for the size, it's just connecting and putting some pillars again. So just connect those all the way. Same on the other side all the way okay and then you just leave a gap of three pillar gap of five pillar but th this pillar will actually go because of the chimney um but you'll see later and then uh, a gap of three again so i don't know if i will do the chimney because i don't really like it um so we're gonna do it without chimney so one, two, three, pillar. Oh, and remove this one. One, two, three, four, five. Remove this one and a pillar all the way again. Then one, two, three again. Pillar five. Pillar and three. So now we have this. Then for the uh, roof, this is actually a little bit complicated, so um, try to keep up with me and do it just like I do. 
Um, now, before we do the roof, we need to do this little uh, part sticking out. So that's just here, here, oh, here, and here. And on the back sides. Not on the sides again. Like that. Then for the roof, uh, yeah, as I said, very complicated. Put a lock. Then you go like this. And put two, I believe. Yes. Then you can just go straight and put two again. Then go diagonal again. One, two, three. Like that. Then go diagonal again. And another three. So now you have this. You'll see if you do it right, um, these two should uh, get to this same pillar always. So one, diagonal two. Straight two, diagonal three, and diagonal three, but this one is already there. So then you have this. Okay, so now for the back side, it's actually totally the same. One, one, diagonal two, diagonal two, straight two, straight two, then one, two, three. 1, 2, 3 diagonal, and another 1, 2, 3 diagonal, that's it, so now we can see this is the same height, so that's, so like that we know we did it right, then for this little um, roof part sticking out, this is actually a little bit complicated too, but you can just recognize it um, because of the pillars at the sides, it's just from starting from there and then doing the same pattern like the big roof. So um, I'm actually gonna do it like on the same side, that's right here then, but uh, you can also do it here, maybe you can do both, nah, <laughs> that would be too, too much work, but um, let's start, so just you follow this pillar and you put one on top, same here, then we go two diagonal again, just like here. Then, I believe we go, yeah, two straight again, two straight, and then three diagonal, and that's it. And like that, um, this is a little bit smaller than these, so that's, that's the cool part about it, I think. So yeah, now we have uh, everything with the oak log, I believe. I don't think uh, there's anything we could do. Oh, yes, we can still do this. So it was first it was like this. You can remove this one and place one like so. And same here. Like that. Um yeah. I think that's it. Okay, so uh, let's move on to the first floor. Okay, so now so now for the second uh, the first floor I mean. We actually just need these blocks. So you could uh, Take all of that. Oh, and oh, of course the door. So that's all we need. Uh, you could also take fence because we'll need that actually too. Uh, yeah, put it right here. These are the materials for this floor. So um, to start off, you just put cobble like this, and you go all the way. Actually, for the interior sakes you could uh, leave this part just for some extra room for maybe a torch or a chest on the inside um, and go like this so for the door you just um, oh let me l see okay for the door you just um, c you can actually choose um, just for a randomness oh well, hello there. <laughs> Just for randomness, I um, put the door. I didn't put the door in the middle. This is the middle, so I put it one block from the middle just to give it some extra, yeah, cool look. So let's do that. Okay, then I forgot that uh, it was a power tool. Well, just like that. Um, then you just go with the cobblestone all around. I'll skip that part because that's just very easy. Also for the floor, you can um, put cobblestone already, that will be um, changed later, but for now we could use just cobblestone. I know it will look weird with the walls, but just 
just believe me, believe me, it will look So better. now, uh, as you can see, it's actually very plain with only the cobblestone, so we're gonna change that a little bit up. If you have a uh, world edit on your server, or single player, I don't know if if you do, uh, you could use this these two commands on just one tool. So I chose the iron pickaxe and I did slash slash, slash um, brush, sphere, cobble and stone brick and then mask it with cobble and stone brick too. So what this does is it will mix up the cobblestone with um, some stone brick in it too. So if I just click right, you, you shall see, ta-da, like that, and you could just keep holding it and it will change up until you like it, and um, then you just keep it. And then for the floor, the same, just mix it up a little and it will look a lot better. Of course, if you don't have this, you, could, you can't use this command, and um, you'll have to do it by hand, but yeah, that's it for um, the walls. Then for some details on the walls, uh, I just went with cobblestone stairs and stone brick stairs and just put them all over the place, just leaving or actually making some gaps in the wall. And you damn... Okay, well... <laughs> so um, for the door you always have to do something like this. Well, you don't have to, but I think it looks better because if you then put the door like this you'll see that it actually gives a cool look. But yeah, then for the cobblestone stairs and uh, stone brick stairs, you could just go crazy if you want. Like that, maybe one, yes, very good. And then maybe one like that. That's good for the front. And then you can do all the sides, I'll skip that part. Then of course we need some windows. So you just go to one of these parts and uh, grab the middle and punch out a window just like this and just put it in of course if you get um, parts like this you just remove this block and place a full block just to get the window right same here for this one actually we need cobblestone like that and yeah for the longer window or the longer part of the wall it's just the same small window like and another spot like that, okay. And another one here. Oh, <laughs> one here too. Uh, oh, damn, what, what's happening? <laughs> okay, like that. And this one here and this one here. Okay, that should look better. Um, yeah, that's it for the randomness and the windows, so now we could just remove these blocks, I don't think so. No, we don't need them anymore. Now we just need these blocks. You can actually remove these and this and this too. So now um, for the bushes, I actually went totally random. Just something like this and maybe like this. Wait, that's too much. Uh, maybe that one. And then just like this. And then you can, uh, f of course, you need some lighting and you can just put a cobblestone wall with a torch on it, like that. You don't do it on every wall though, because it will just look weird, but you can do it on some walls actually. Um, but as you can see, it's just a matter of placing leaves and, and deleting them again, because sometimes it just doesn't look that natural. You, you'll know what I mean when you try by yourself. You actually don't have to copy this. Oh wait, that, that's actually very weird. <laughs> you don't... Oh, come on, why? You don't have to copy it um, like I do, but you can if you're not sure how to. So we can place another torch here and we're gonna go all the way. I'll skip that part again. Okay, now I did all the sides. Uh, I can show you very fast. I actually don't really uh, went for the perfect look but um, I just placed some leaves because for the sake of the video it can't take that long. Um, then we will make this these supporting um, sort of pillars and we ju you just put it here, here and at the back side here and here just like that. Um, then you can grab 
some stone buttons. You could also use um, some trap doors, but I think there's a lot of trap doors already in this build, so you don't have to put them like this again. So just to use buttons. You could choose um, stone buttons or wooden buttons, but I went for the stone because otherwise it's stone, wool, and wood, wool and wood, and I wanted some kind of yeah part where there's still stone in the in the first and second floor so i went for the cobblestone wall here and the stone buttons on these parts so yeah you just put them on this this one this one all the logs sticking out and on the back of course the same like oh like that okay and uh, let's move on to the next floor, I guess. For the next floor, you actually need um, some spruce wood stairs. You need wool. You need a trapdoor. You need fence. You need um, fence gate. You need um, spruce wood slab. Wow. Um, cobblestone wall. And yes, glass panes. Oh, by the way, you could uh, use gray stained glass panes like these or white stained even or gray stained you could just choose um you could also actually use some fence uh, for windows but i think there's a lot of wood already in the build so i wanted some glass in it um so for the first floor you actually go the, like the same it's one block on the inside not uh, like this but one back so you start here and you just go like this yeah this floor is a little bit bigger than the first or yeah the the ground floor because it's a pillar of six and not a pillar of five like here so then you get this and you do it all the way around just make sure it's one in and not actually um, between the pillars like this not like this one back that's all so just fill it in and I'll skip this just like that so uh, I filled the whole build in with um, uh, white wool yeah that's that's what it called so. <laughs> um, so now for the details on the walls uh, it's actually more complicated than this floor because it yeah it has a certain form if you know what I mean so um, for the parts uh, of three and um, five, yes, three and five. You you have an, another design than uh, the parts for five and by five. So for the parts for um, three by five, you just go like this: spruce wood stair. Then you go spruce wood slabs here. Then you punch out a window and put the glass panes in. Uh, let me see, yeah. And then you go like this look very closely not like this but one higher and that's because we can then put some um, what's it called wooden trapdoor yes that's it <laughs> wooden trapdoors uh, wow okay wooden trapdoors beneath it so if you go like this you can't put one there so we don't want that um, and then for the top you just go fence, fence gate open, and fence, and you do that on every three parts. Uh, I'll skip that part. Um, see you on the. Wow, I suck at commentary. See you when I'm done. Okay, so I um, did all the parts of three by five, and this is how it looks right now. So for the parts uh, five by five, we just go like this. Let me check. Yeah. Then trap doors again. Put your glass panes in. Then you go like this. So for now, it actually looks like this, right? But now you put an extra slab here and here. An extra slab here and here. And then you just go like this instead of this so you can see it's something else then uh, for this parts you could place some fence like that I'll do it on the other side see you when okay I'm done. now we did that there's only one 
thing left of course the roof plus these little parts inside um but actually uh, i i checked the time of the video and i think it's too long already so um guys of course i'll make another video for the roof because also the roof is very complicated too as you can see it has a little curve in it um, you can see it on the background and that's actually not that easy to explain or make actually so um, you'll see that uh, yeah next episode I'll make it a two episodes built I hope you enjoyed that stupid slime yeah that's it thanks for watching oh of course um, I'll make a warp to this place so if you join on any server you could use the warp to check out the houses um, for now yeah there won't be a war because this is only the first house but i'll make one later thanks for watching be sure to check out uh, only server and also the channels in the description i'll place them with a link check them out and maybe subscribe thanks for watching hope you liked it bye